Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com coming at you with our final case of 2015 Topps Chrome Football. Uh, pick your team number 12. Pick your team number 12 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Big thanks to all of these folks for doing work. There it is. Good. Excellent. There's everyone. Heggs with that last bot mojo. And there you go. Thanks, everybody. All right, where's my, there's my knife. I don't know, Axel just snapped. It was like that TV show, Snapped. All right, good luck everybody. Remember this is 2015. Like I said, we'll have Axel help out a little bit. Scoot this over. So we'll shift the camera angle this way. So I know it's sort of an awkward angle, but it's just to keep everything on camera. This will make things go a little bit faster. So that way we can have some time to maybe do another break. So if you're watching a replay of this, obviously nothing exciting is really happening here, so feel free to fast forward. Uh, if you're watching live, you're stuck with me. You're stuck with me. <laughs> In your Raza top. Yeah, sorry, Rich. You're, you're, you're stuck with me here. What's up, Curtis? Uh, they do... Uh... <laughs> Thanks, Rich. Yeah, I, I am looking forward to that new Tupac movie. That looks pretty good, right? Um, just, well, let's just start... I, I put a slash through everything, so just start taking out the packs first, and then we'll start ripping them open. Sure you have. No, on, on the other, it's, they're already ripped. Oh, they're already ripped. Yeah. There you go. Just keep it on camera, and you'll be good. They don't trust me. No, they don't trust you, Axel. That's the whole point of this. You can, you can just tear it open. Yeah, there you go. You got it. I ice my hands. This is easy. If this was like a, if this was like a twenty. You know, go and slide this on camera right here too. If this was like a twenty case break, yeah. Now one case, one case easy. We can handle one case. There we go. Alright, we'll open up all these two. This might be the fastest chrome break we've ever done. Oh. Watch out. So, start. Probably uses this ladder. Okay. 
Don't unplug that. That would be a disaster. Tice, you want us to bring some 84 Tops football wax packs back? So try to keep your hands straight. Right there. Nobody knew your name for like later on in life, really, quite AJ. Oh, yeah. <laughs> later on in life? Like, oh, when yeah, was this? I'm like, serious, two years like, ago? I'm serious. No, no, like, this was, like, <laughs> I can't. Like, I didn't find out his name was like Axel until like fifth or sixth grade. Oh, were you embarrassed of your name, Axel? No, no I just like, say everything like, yeah. When I was in kindergarten, my mom would come into class and say, call me AJ for my initials. <laughs> I was like, your name's Axel? I was like, what? I don't know if there's any space for Jason to help out. There's no room in this room. This, this studio is much smaller than Jason's studio. Jason's studio is nice. He's got a lot of, he's got a lot of space in there. I am a big man. It doesn't, so. it doesn't get as hot in there either. No studio lights. 24-hour breakathon like Le Mans? I will be 24 hours soon one day. Yeah, yeah. Just hire, hire enough breakers and Some move, right to, after we leave. move to a bigger store. Oh my god. <laughs> Could have been disastrous. <laughs> like, that's the one with the Mariota in it. No, no Rich is gone, that's fine. Oh, Rich. <laughs> nice. I know, I know, I know. Remember, the super crackers are really dark here. Can't uh, the super I know, I'm, I, I just told the sipping team just to look on the backs in case I missed one. <laughs> this, is, this is where I found the girly. It, it was impossible to see. I just felt it because of the serial number on the back. That's impossible. I mean, like after I mean after that, it's kind of impossible after that. I'm just gonna look on the back of each card afterwards. I'm still on my first stack. Are you serious? <laughs> well, we Maybe Axel's not gonna be a breaker. <laughs> Where you learn. Yeah, Arthur's like, if only Joe could grow a beard, like, yeah, Axel can grow some good facial hair. I've got a summer beard, Arthur. A summer beard. Some, some are here, some are there. See? You come for the break, stay for the jokes. Nah, I think like. Two months ago. Two. kind of makes me dizzy. So Gabe, Gabriel, what was your charity idea? Ga where, so video gamers play video games for 24 hours to earn donations to towards kids' hospitals. Well then what would we do? We, need, we would need to sell out breaks for 24 hours. To donate a portion of that to to charity, you know what I mean? Yeah, this case has been marinating for a while. It's been probably sitting in some some cold, cold warehouse, you know, for two years until it ended up into into our hands.
so no vet base ships in this, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sure everybody read the item description. Everyone always reads the item description. No vet base. And everything else ships. A lot of fun parallels. A lot of good times. 2015, so think think back to your 2015 rookies. Mariota's in this. I think Amari Cooper is a rookie in 2015. David Johnson's a rookie. Uh, Melvin Gordon, yep. Todd Gurley. Actually, yeah, Tice, that's a good call. This is a good time. Well, if you're watching live, this is a great time to fill up another break. And then Winston and Mariota, obviously. Actually, yeah, now that you mentioned that, guess what? I'm going to... 2015 NFL Draft. Let's, let's go back. So while we're doing this boring part, we might as well talk about the 2015 Draft. Oh, Dante Fowler Jr. went number three. I mean, I don't know. Defensive ends, kind of unsung heroes. You never really... Unless he just like balls out and starts... Uh, you know, Khalil macking it. It's kind of hard to really get it. But there's Amari Cooper. Brandon Schreff was a offensive tackle. Leonard Williams is in there. Kevin White, if he could stay healthy, could be cool. Eric Beasley's there. I've seen some Eric Flowers autographs. Trey Waynes will be there. Danny Shelton. I mean, you can't call anyone a bust yet, right? After just two seasons, you know? But like, I think with their, with of this draft class anyway, with their third season coming up this year, this is where you start to think, hey, do they have it or do they don't? Right, Jason? Like you, you can't call anybody a, a, a bust, right? From this class yet, you gotta give them another season or two. But like this third year, yeah, rookie contracts start to go, start to... I haven't heard anything about Shane Ray in a while for the Broncos. He's a Super Bowl champ. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he won his rookie year or something. Yeah, my favorite draft pick for Marcus but Kevin White is not really a bust, he's just been injured. He's just been injured, yeah, so you can't really knock Kevin White for that. Dante Fowler's injured his first year, Marcus too. Peters. Peters is, well, Peters had like 14 interceptions in there. Like, Parker? Yeah, Jamarcus Russell, you kind of knew he was a bust from like year one. He wanted so much money. Well, that's before they started doing those. That's, Jamarcus Russell was the big reason why they changed the CBA. I think the last one was Stafford. Yeah, yeah to, to, to make Cameron, sure. Or Cam Newton. Yeah, one of those guys. But those guys were the big reasons why they changed it. So there would only the rookie contracts would be capped at a certain amount for, for the first round overall, second, third, etc. Et it's not fair to pay a rookie. Jeez, a hundred million dollars well, for Marcus Russell. The most, was like, like half of it was guaranteed too. That's crazy. Man, in. <laughs> yeah, but thankfully he turned out to be pretty decent. Yeah, no, you know what I mean? Like he's good, you know. But I like Amir Abdullah too, Johnny. Like I, I think he started to kind of turn things around uh, this past season until he got that that uh, foot thing, foot fracture or something like that. This is not a bad draft. I mean, if Gurley turned, turns it back on this season, we got a better offense now, so. Or a better coach for offense. But, like, everyone thought Melvin Gordon was going to be a bust in 2015, but then he had a great 2016. I still think he's a bust. You still think he's a bust? You're a Chargers fan, too. Why? Something about him? You just give him a ball too much. Oh. That's for crazy. Oh, so you're saying? So you're just saying he just volumes it, so that's why he look, he, look, he looks good. Okay, it's possible, yeah. It's a good documentary. Oh, no worries, Johnny. 
got politics in it. Who else is in this draft class right there? Second round. Landon yeah, Landon Collins. Eric Kendrick should have been a first round pick. Yeah, well, he's a big part of that that Vikings defense, right? Jason Taylor, Jordan Punches. TJ Yeldon was in the second round of this one. Mario Edwards Jr., I think, has had some neck issue or something like that, but I think he should be healthy this season. Oh. Devin Smith, can he be something for the I mean, yeah, he did he really? Hmm. Maybe not. Devin Funches, maybe. I like him. <laughs> Who? Jason, I, I was so high on him because he was such a great player, but Who? they would never get Funches. him the ball. Oh, Funches? Especially when once inning went down, I was like, this guy's going to get the ball all day, but I don't know. They never want to throw to him. So you think TJ Elton got straight up replaced this year? Probably. I mean, I mean, a lot, a lot of teams run like, you know, yeah, backs. you kind of need two running backs this day and age. I think they still need TJ Yeldon to to be effective. But I think the, the the days of like, you know, give the rock to Adrian Peterson 35, 40 times a game is... Yeah, is, now he's going to be sharing with Mark Ingram. You know, it doesn't really happen anymore. I think a lot of teams run, like have like two two running backs that they can use somewhat interchangeably or two like with different skill sets or something like that. You think this is Eli's last year? Like, what, he'll retire after this year? I don't think he'll retire after this year, will he? Eli Manning? Mm. <laughs> I don't know, those Copperfit commercials. He says he thinks he... Yeah, exactly. Like, Rick saying... You know, Jeremy Hill and Giovanni Bernard, yeah, they kind of run that two that two running back sort of set. I mean, like in Oakland, they're not they're not just gonna go they're not just gonna go with you know Marshawn Lynch for like 30, 40 snaps a game, you know, 30 carries a game kind of thing. You know, they they're gonna work in a lot of the other young guys too. I think that's the that's the nature of the of the NFL these days. Uh, running backs are like, running backs are, their careers are frighteningly short. It's kind of scary, like how short their careers are compared to other players. So if you have like great running back, why not try to, why not try to extend their careers? You know, so. I think, you know, let's... TJ Yeldon. It's okay. Leonard DeMarco Fournette. Murray and, and, and Henry. Yeah, DeMarco Murray and Derrick Henry. That's going to be a crazy backfield in Tennessee. Now you got some wide receivers. Now you got a better defense. Tennessee's going to win the division. I think they could. How's their defense? Defense is pretty good, right? They got, um... Sanders are gonna have two good running backs. They got Christian McCaffrey. Who did they grab the magician? Juju Smith. Juju Smith Schuster. No. Um, they got Corey. No, they got sorry. They got, they got Corey Davis. Davis. Yeah. They got a Corey Jackson. You should have put a first round pick too. Nate Beckham says Lynch, Marshawn Lynch is 100 percent going to get injured and miss half Savage. the season. He's fresh. Savage. Jeez, I know he might as well have said that. Brutal. I mean, I think that I think the fact that the Raiders are not using a, you know, are not going to use him like as a bell cow kind of running back. I think the, I think he his his legs will stay fresher. I think. <laughs> Arthur throwing shade at you, dude. Oh, yeah. Arthur's like Joe. Joe opens nine boxes. Oh, Axel opens three. One, one for three is not bad. That that saved that saved me ten minutes right there, Arthur. Thanks, Axel. <laughs> This is my second time packs. That's, I think I'm, I think I'm just... That saves me 10 minutes in this break. That 10 minutes can be used to bust open NT NASCAR. You realize that? That's, that's the importance.
Yeah, that's true, Kristen. I mean, the year off could be a blessing or a curse. You never know. I mean... I, we should have, actually. I, I wish I would have thought of that, Rick. Rick's like, we should have put Axel's boxes to one side to see if he has any extra mojo. It's true. What stuff did I do? I have no idea. They're all mixed up in here now. I did three, so. I don't know. They're, mine, right? they're in here somewhere. Yeah, that one. That one's definitely yours. All right. This one. Okay. I, I think that You're one. You're gonna see them because the cards are this, this one. This one. Whoa. And that one. <laughs> You're gonna be big cards. <laughs> yeah, the 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 ones that end up coming back being graded as like Eight. six fives. <laughs> six five Mariota. Yeah, those those are those are the Axel ones right here. All right. So if I, there you go. So everything's still on camera. Right there, good. <laughs> All right, so that makes life a lot easier, folks. So thanks to Axel for that. Let's slide these over right here. I don't know which. We'll just save. This is an Axel stack right here. We'll just save that right there. See what happens. Okay. Good thing Super Fractor. It's all right. It's still so well. If we even find the Super Fractor. All right. Good luck, everybody. Adjust the camera angle a little bit. There we go. All right. So we're going to start off with. I'm going to I'm going to breeze by these green ones because they are they they'll ship but they're not um they're not numbered. There's Cody Fajardo. Out of 399. So one autograph per box and then a handful of, I think a couple numbered cards at least. These pulsars are not numbered as well unless they're autographed. They also still ship. Unless we mix up the stacks, every stack should have one auto on average. <laughs> There's Jay Cutler green. Again, not numbered. There's Sepia, Aaron Rodgers, nice, at a 99 for the Packers. That'll go to Ryan. And Vic Beasley, nice blue auto. That's uh, out of 50. Nice one for the Dirty Birds. Bulldog fan with that one. There you go, Bulldog fan. There you go. Uh, Dylan is asking, aren't you guys relocating? We're, I mean, we're looking for a larger space for Jaspie's Hobbyland, but we're not really, not anytime soon. I mean, I guess if we find a good deal, you know, like if we find a good deal tomorrow, then we'll move. But as of now, we have, we have nothing yet, but we are looking. Leave up these parallels as well, might as well, as we go along. Again, these pulsars not numbered. Jay Color also a broadcaster now. No, we're not we're not moving states. We are we're going to we're staying in beautiful Southern California. David Johnson, nice. Riley card collector, David with that one. Nice. David with the David. Doriel Green Beckham pink. Out of 3.99. Go all the way out to Tulsa. Spencer and TJ would be fans of that. I have no, I have no problem with Oklahoma. My aunt went to OU. Had family in Dallas. Lorenzo Maldin, so got no problem with that area. Out of four ninety nine, camo for the Jets. That will go to uh, Ryan with the Jets. 
go south to the LBC. Well, actually, Gabriel, one of the stores we're looking at is uh, is right off the 405. So then you wouldn't have to drive all the way in from the 405. It'd be a lot easier, and easier for me too in my commute. There's Travis Kelsey Blue. Out of two, out of 199, that is. That'll be for uh, Ryan and the Chiefs. Are, th are the thicker cards variations? We'll, we'll, we'll pull those out as we as we go along. I haven't felt any thicker cards yet. Let the shipping team look at them too. It's a nice David Johnson there. Let's slide this over. There's Jeremy Langford for the Bears. That will go to John C. Bo Wallace. Shaq Thompson, refractor. I think those refractors are not numbered. Antoine Goodley. These blue waves are not numbered as well, but they'll still ship out. Jameson Crowder. That's out of 299. That'll be for Ryan. Marcus Allen die cut. We've got to paint Carlos Hyde for the Niners. That goes to Avery. 214 out of 399. And Chris Connolly right here. Then yeah, once once Jaspies expands to to a larger location, we'll be able to do a lot more things. Higher, have more breakers, break it more more times during the day. You get a lot of people that say, "Hey, I wish you guys uh, started doing did breaks later." Uh, some people are like, "Hey, I wish you guys were on earlier." So we'll try to try to be on for everybody. There's Eli Manning. Sometimes these are autographed. They're pretty cool. Lawrence Taylor, Super Bowl die cut. And there's Earl Thomas, camo refractor, 312 out of 499. That goes to the Seahawks cruise with that one. And there's Ben Koyak for the Jaguars. Nice, no number, but that's a nice one for Rick. Rick Hunt and the Jaguars. Randy Gregory Pulsar and Trey McBride. Nelson Aguilar Black Refractor at a two ninety nine. And there's Landon Collins in the back there. Chris Dunn says the more I think. The more time for Jaspi to stay open, the more your bank account cries. Well, I 
here's what you need to do, Chris, is uh, you got you to gotta tell your friends about Jaspies. Get them in on the action. You know, share the joy and the misery. <laughs> That's what you got to do. Share the joy and the misery of Jaspies Hobbyland. That's why you're not the only one. And that's the thing, folks. Like we we've been, I know we have a lot of uh, the same, a lot of regulars that that are here, but Is there you know, yep. We have a lot of regulars here, but we have uh, our audience has been growing pretty steadily for a while, and every little bit helps. You know, there'll be there'll always be like two new people who tried a few tried tried the breaks a few times. Maybe we get. If I get like one regular out of, you know, if I get one regular out of uh, one regular a week, you know, I mean, that's that's a pretty good return. RG3, 177 out of 399 pink for Ryan. But you know what? We just try to build as, grow and as organically as possible. You know what I mean? Slowly but surely. That's how we try to do it. Marius Thomas, Jalen Collins, and Amir Abdullah, Fear Amir, Sepia, 34 out of 99. That goes to the Lions, Brandon Richards. Uh, is that Thin Eddie Lacey? I think back, I think back in 2015, that would be Thin Eddie Lacey. 1,000-yard club. Sean Mannion. And there's Josh Robinson. That's the autograph for the Colts. Reggie with the Josh. So let me sleeve all of these up and we'll get to the next stack which represents a box and because uh axel helped me out with the pack stacking we should be done with this break a little bit sooner so we'll have a chance to uh to, to maybe knock out another break before we call it a night maybe a quick short one i think people were talking uh people were talking nascar perhaps Is that mariota variation i'll pull it it didn't seem or feel any different you know, that's the Mariota right there. But maybe there's other photo variations too, perhaps. All right, next one. Devonta Freeman, is that gonna be a catch? That might be a catch. Out of 499 camo refractor for the Falcons. That's another one for Bulldog fan. Will with that one. Terry Bradshaw, Super Bowl die cut. Tony Lippett for the Dolphins. Pink out of 399. And that will go to Armando with the Dolphins. Doriel Green Beckham, Pulsar. And Austin Hill is your refractor autograph out of uh, 150, 34 out of 150. Going to the Jets, Jets, Jets. That's for Ryan. Let's see if there's another parallel to find out of here. Antonio Gates. There's Jeremy Hill, blue. Out of 199, that'll go to the Bengals. That's for Heggs. Doriel Green Beckham. Yeah, um, I've been looking at the the sides of the cards, 
because it sh it'll be pretty obvious when one is slightly thicker than the other cards. But so far, it's just been uh, it's just been the refractors that have been on the thicker side, and not just the regular cards. So Johnny's new to breaking, and breaking with us. And he says, I'm going to be very selective on the next, with the breaks that you join. Well, that's good. And as long as you have, you know, set your budget. And then kind of determine what you are looking for out of a product. You know, some people are like, hey, you know what? I like, you know, I like base heavy products. I like to build sets. Some people are like, I just want hits. Some people are, I want super high end stuff. You know, I want, you know, lower end stuff where I could, you know, chase like more rainbows and parallels and all that. So everyone has their different reasons for breaking. And as, once you find yours, it's Josh Robinson, Black Refractor out of 299 for the Colts. It's another one for Reggie. And that'll be good. And coming up here, these don't pop out of here very often. Nelson Aglor, three color patch and on card auto. Nice, that's 27 out of 50 for the Philadelphia Eagles. Fly, Eagles, fly. Going to Heggs at his last spot mojo. Nice. See, I think this feels like a variation. So you can kind of tell right here that that Mariota is thicker than the other regular cards. You can kind of feel it as you break as well. <coughs> so that is the variation as opposed to, I think the other one was, was normal. So that Titans Mar uh, Mariota variation will go to Cruz. There's a Pulsar Shane Ray. Benjamin McKinney and Sepia, Sepia Cedric, 51 out of 99. All right, and the next one. Uh, tomorrow, it'll be uh, Prestige and Finest Baseball will be out tomorrow. Those are our two new releases. I, we, I'm sure we're going to get some of that TriStar because I know the new TriStar Quest is out. We usually get at least a case or two. Oh yeah, Tag thinks he should get a free break for the thickness tip on the on the on the variations. Tell me how much that Mariota variation will go for on a secondary market. Then we'll then we'll talk. How about just my thanks isn't enough? My my deep deep appreciation. So these are the. Uh, there's usually one box with those blue diamond variations. 23 out of 50, Max Williams. Rashad Perryman. That uh, gold Max goes to Arthur with the Ravens. Tom Brady, Sean Mannion. There's Mariota. Omar Miller. And Landon Collins for the New York Football Giants. That goes to Omar. Nice. Julio Jones. There you go. Out of two ninety nine, Alshon Jeffrey. And that'll go to that's still Bears edition of Alshon Jeffrey. John C with that one. Nick Foles. Jameis Winston. Vince Maley. T.J. Yeldon, Toriel Green Beckham, Randy Gregory, Shane Ray, 
RG3, Mark Ingram, Carlos Hyde, Pulsar, Devin Smith, and a few more in this stack right here. Sammy Watkins, CJ Spiller, Joy Bell, and Antoine Goodley. All right. <laughs> should I eggs? I know, I should. Probably should one touch all those blue diamond ones, Alexis. That is for that is for sure. Well, Brandon, we, I mean, we just can't tell people just to buy that break. Sell them on it while I'm doing this break. Tell them what, why they should buy into that NASCAR break. What's exciting about it? What are what are you? Why did you get into the break? What excited you about it? Instead of just saying, "Hey, just buy," most people would be like, "Eh, why? NASCAR? I don't know about NASCAR." And then you'll tell them, hey, $20 gets you four random numbers in a one-box random number break. That's what you would tell them. And then you would say, oh, man, National Treasure is such a great brand. And think about how there's a lot of racing fans who don't have not a lot of stuff in the hobby for racing. You can get some of the biggest names in racing. Could go for a lot on a secondary market. Out of two ninety nine, dollars Justin Hardy. Worst case scenario is you... Uh, is you don't get anything. There's Dries Anderson, Camo Refractor, 55 out of 99 for Avery. Worst case scenario, hey. I want a bonus auto. Eli Harold for Avery. On a sepia parallel out of 150. There you go, Avery. Worst case scenario, 20 bucks. I mean, that's in the case break world, that's relatively inexpensive for a box of national treasures. A break with a box of national treasures. There's Larry Fitzgerald Pink out of 399. The Brashad Perriman back here. All right. Let's sleeve all these up and top load them. Yeah, Curtis, we should have plenty of time for that. All of that, of course, is on jazpyshobbyland.com. I see zero orders in. Oh, no, there's one from Chris Dunn that just came in a few minutes ago. So otherwise, what, what do we do with the Topps Huddle cards? They go into the trash can. And that's where they go. All right, three more boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. So a few more autographs to go, like Matt Jones, refractor autograph out of 150. Royal for speed, Ryan with that one. Pulsar, Jameis Winston. May as well sleeve that for the Buccaneers. Goes to Fidel. Arian Foster. And pink to Marco Murray. 93 out of 399 for the Eagles. Terrence McGee. AJ Green, Pink Austin Hill for Ryan and the Jets at a 3.99, and there's Marcus Murphy back here. Almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Chris Dunn saying NASCAR is down to seven, so that order from Chris must have been a NASCAR spot. Need a little more help than that. 
I just got to fill by the end of the break if we're going to, or end of this break if we're going to do it. If not, Curtis is ready to pull the trigger on a Star Wars Evolution box. Oh, these were the cards out of that one. And then that will make it the last break of the night. Okay. Uh, Tyler Croft is your autograph right up front. Heggs with the bangles. Mar Miller. Tyler Lockett. You're starting, yeah, you are starting an Austin Hill PC. Antoine Goodley, pink, Cowboys out of 399. That is one for Arthur, pink parallel. Andy Dalton out of 299. That is 174 out of 299, by the way. Uh, Heggs with the Bengals. Eric Decker Pulsar that we just flashed by. Josh Harper back there. There we go. The axle box. I, I don't. I there were other axle boxes tucked away in there. At least two of them. So, but I'm not sure which ones they were because we kind of mixed them up into the main stack. But we know for sure that one is an axle stack. Now, does he have the magic hands or not? We're going to find out in just a few moments, folks. Or <laughs> right after these messages. Then we go to commercial. They're like, no, I want to know what the axle box had. Just have to wait. All right. Last but not least, good luck, everybody. Philip Dorsett. David Corn on the cob. This is numbered right here, and you looked a little different. 63 out of 99. Kurt Warner, Rams. Indomic and Sue, pink. 008 out of 399. That'll go to the Dolphins. That will be for Armando with the Dolphins. Julian Edelman, green. Kenny Bell, refractor. Javorius Allen. RG3, Danny Shelton. Jesse James Pink out of 399. And Carlos Williams is your autograph. That goes to the Bills for Brandon Richards. Percy Harvin and Malcolm Brown. And there you go, folks. That's it. That was your break. That was 2015. Tops Chrome Football. Pick your team number 12 from jazbeeshobbyland.com on a Tuesday, the 6th of June. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Have a great night. We will see you next time with some more football. Bye-bye. There is no next time.